After a fantastic episode in which we bid Remy farewell and welcomed Edwin into our lives, Heartland will resume with episode 3 on the following Sunday. I'm here to talk about what will happen in the newest episode, which is named The Heart Wants. Let's start now. In the third episode, Amy will assist Caleb with his son's pony, Lou and Jessica will launch a new business, and Katie will experiment with a new hobby. Meanwhile, Logan will take a significant step in his relationship with Miley, only for disaster to strike. Let's examine this synopsis using the brief preview we have. The Amy and Caleb plotline begins both the summary and the trailer. The preview shows Caleb removing Carson's pony from the truck and asking Amy for assistance. The trailer makes it apparent that the beast is excessively violent and knocks Caleb off his feet as Amy wonders what the issue is. I understand that Caleb needs assistance with the pony, but I had hoped that this episode would focus more on the development of Amy and Edwin's romance. Maybe Amy will talk about Edwin with Caleb and he will get jealous. I'm just waiting to see how we will get to that scene in the trailer with that man who I think is Caleb kissing Amy. Perhaps Caleb will have a growing interest in Amy now that he is getting divorced. We'll see. The preview and the synopsis continue with Lou and Jessica's storyline. At first, we see Tim talking to Lou about the aftermath of the Merrill race. Lou seems upset and tired, but Tim tells her to get off the mat and accept that she was beaten in the race. I don't know if this is the right way to motivate someone to get over something, but it seems to have worked since the synopsis says Lou and Jessica are starting up a new venture. In the preview, Jessica says she wants to open her own gallery which is quite ambitious but when she combines powers with Lou, there's nothing those ladies cannot do. Also, it's nice to see Jessica because she and Lisa have been absent from season 17 so far. Lisa does not seem to be in this episode as well. She has gone somewhere but was on the phone with Jack in episode 2 so we know she is alive. Here's where the synopsis and the preview go their separate ways. I want to talk about the preview first because it introduces us to a new character. Amy is riding a horse in the fields and sees a guy in a cowboy hat. She raises a hand to say hi and he tilts his head to say hi back. I first saw this guy in the official trailer for this season and I think he is Nathan Jr., the son of the guy who was beefing with Heartland. Do you remember the man who put billboards of his face all around Hudson and bought Sam's grazing land right next to Heartland? I think they are now using that land and Nathan Jr. is already there. That's how he sees Amy and they meet. I wonder if they'll be just acquaintances or have a bad relationship because of the rivalry between their families. I don't think Amy can be enemies with anyone so I think she will be friendly towards this guy. He seems nice at first glance. We'll see if something will happen between them. The preview ends there but the synopsis informs us about two more storylines. One is about Katie trying out a new hobby. In one promo, I saw her looking at a motorcycle like she was in love with it so she might try to get on one. The other storyline is about Logan trying to take a big step in his relationship with Miley but it says it ends up in a disaster so Miley may not feel the same way about him. It's hard to guess since we didn't witness much about their relationship. That's all I have to say about episode 3. I'll see you next week after the episode is released. Until then, share your thoughts with me in the comments below. Do you think the writers give Amy too many options with Edwin Caleb and the new guy? Write them down.